see you. I hope it will go even better. Are you here to buy? Indeed I am. I feel quite hungry. Was it I needed? I could do with a bite to eat. Come right up and take some home. The rooms for your house. Great. Oh. Oh. Trees like that. Aye, but better to save a few if I can. Greetings. Want to try your luck? Dice? I feel quite hungry. That'll do me. Fabric, thread, buttons, laces. Come, people, come. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to? He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts, traitors. Now even the Pope be with you, is Henry. opposed to your king. I'm with you, Matthew. So What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. What do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself. 
can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? You too, I, Matthew. You should give him a proper hiding. <sighs> Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlement You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, don't some tears all day. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Radzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Oh well, father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. I could do with a bite to eat. So are we doing this or not? Wait, we have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. I have to eat something. My insides are shriveled up with the hunger. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. Next thing he'll start on about the popes. He might have mentioned the popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight.
What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! This is all good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes! You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse Hans! I'll make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutscher? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! Ah, yes. Sorry. It's just that's never happened to me before. What do you think you're playing at? Are you trying to get yourselves in trouble? The Deutsch was insulting King Wenceslas. He got what he deserved. So that's why. Deutsch isn't a bad fellow. But he should drop this nonsense about Sigismund before someone torches his house. So you don't mind that we... Don't gape like a stuffed squirrel. Do you take me for a German lover? I serve my lord and my lord serves the king and that's Wenceslas. But what to do with you now? Deutsch will make trouble if I let you off. So I won't go to jail? Ha! Who pay for your grub? You know what? The Deutsch got what he deserved. I'll go and have a word with your father and we'll straighten it out somehow. Now clear off before I change my mind. Uh, don't you start. Oh well, I wouldn't mind if I to read actually. Oh, God damn it, my stomach hurts. 